And Rich Trapper tapping in. TNN Trap News Network. You feel me? Rich Trapper. The homie wanted you to uh, whitelist this shit too. Ooh. Rich Trapper. Rich Trapper. He be reacting to your shit. Trap and TNN Trap News Network. We back in action with another reaction video. Back in this thing. Back in this thing. Like, cook, crack in this thing, man. Make sure you like. Make sure you comment. Make sure you subscribe. For more of the content we got going on here at TNN Trap News Network, some news excuse, some knowledge you can't get in college, big dog. Hit that subscribe button. Become a part of this rich trapper mafia. Hit that notification bell at the top, right there at the top. Hit all say tabs in for the latest and the greatest of what we have going on here at TNN Trap News Network. Get into that if you haven't gotten into all that. Uh, what else do I need to tell y'all about? My newest single, something gone. That's out now, man. Get into that if you ain't got it to that. It's still take your kids to work day. Little homie has a day off from school. Bro, bro, I'm making a video. Okay. Can I can I get a second? Yeah. Appreciate you. Um little homie right there. Uh <laughs> he didn't have school today. Why he didn't have school today, I have no idea. But I picked him up from school yesterday. And school was like, yeah, see you Monday. Monday. All right, I feel like these kids are never in school, but whatever. I digress. Something gone. That's my newest singles. That's what got him here because I had something gone. You know, it happens. Either way, go, man. Make sure y'all get into that. Make sure you also get into the live premium, uh, premium li live, live resin disposable cartridges brought to you by Tasty. Premium, terp, premium derived from premium cannabis. No, ter I've been blowing in the park. He went to the park. You know what's annoying? When you go to the park with your kid and you're like, you know, woo-wop and woo bammy and then like another kid comes, like, why are you here? I'm over here trying to spend time with my kid and put one in the air real quick and then you got to find like another little corner because you're not sure if the other parent's really cool with the blah, blah. It, it, it really becomes inconvenient. Um, to parents who don't partake, if you see us in the park partaking with our kid, find a whole new park, bro. Like, just you go somewhere else. Stop inconveniencing us. It's more places for you to go than it is for us to go. We specifically picked that park for a reason because we are comfortable partaking in what we partake in, but only the Grobles, only the Grobles. And that's why we picked that park, bro. So stop bringing your kids there. You go somewhere else. You feel me? That's that. Um, especially the parks that's like in a cut. Nobody knows about but you. How do you even know about this park? I get it. We all live in this upper middle class neighborhood, but sheesh, go away. Signature Honey Wraps brought to you by T.I. Make sure you get to those, man. I ain't finna hold y'all no longer. We finna jump into this Contiana. We got Adam 22. We got Famous Richard, and they're having an awkward conversation about what Famous Richard had to say about Adam 22's child. We finna jump into this Contiana without no further ado's or don'ts. Three, two, one, let's go. He told Wack 100 that he made me, gang. <laughs> it looked like... He probably didn't no. help your shit, But, but listen, yeah. listen. By far, the biggest... Already, the most views you've ever got on anything was from that No, he's not going you famous. No, the most huge you've ever got on anything is on No Jumper. No Jumper made you famous. Bow! Right hook. But 10 Richard, million views. You were a little richer. Let me see your pipe. Now you're famous, Richard. Ten million. Bro said you were a little richer. Now you're famous, Richard. Views off that. Right. Oh, but a million, million off that, that. A million YouTube views on a full length podcast plus all of those clips with many hundreds gang, of thousands of views on, on each one. I'll put two on, gang. We My made you famous, Richard. No. We had to change the YouTube titles. The old one said I'll Little Richard. Y'all did. Y'all did. Y'all put the West Coast on me and shit, like, put, put me out there a little bit, but you ain't make me famous, gang. Mm -hmm. You could you contribute to my, to my, to my, to my, to my, uh, my, my, little, my little fame a little bit out here. Out here. Oh, BD. Whenever his, your name comes up, people say, oh, that dude, that Crip Mac was about to beat his Man, ass oh, for oh, you. Guys, I was going to roll Crip Mac Which, that was you. not even my plan. Let's, okay, let's be real. I was going to roll both of y'all. Crip Mac would destroy you. Oh, BD, and why Crip Mac ain't want to no. fight? Why he ain't want to fight? Why he tell me to come to Baby Snap Alley? Oh, BD. Uh, <laughs> That's where they fight people. Why he tell me to come to Baby? So I'm not finna come to, come to the rack and come to my alley. That's where they beat people. Come to my alley. No, no. He's absolutely correct. The pack is he going to baby snap? Why would I go to baby snap? Nah, if yeah, I got yeah, twenty thousand yeah, yeah, yeah. on the fight. Yeah, it's probably not worth you going to Baby Snaps Alley, big dog. Uh, if you're not uh, associated with Baby Snaps in any type of way, uh, shape, form, or fashion, shout out to Baby Snaps. We got nothing but love here but uh, TNN Trap News Network for Baby Snaps and the affiliation of Baby Snaps. And even those who don't like Baby Snaps, we got love for you too, bro, because we don't have no type of woo wop booty bams with whatchamacallit or the full flammery. However, you probably don't want to go into that one. Oh, it's probably. Smart move, smart move, because I might have been a huh, packy wacky outy wowdy. Right now, I got Josh NYC. He gonna put that shit together. Twenty racks. He's talking about nah. I wanna fight cuz the baby snap alley on King. Josh <laughs> YNC. YNC. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> you Josh know what that YNC. Is? Not yeah, he's trying yeah, to uh, yeah, put that yeah. together on bees. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> I just give my boy a shout Why out because that's, that's our boy too. Well, my boy. 
But I want to I want to fight too though, gang. I ain't gonna lie. I want to I want to go across those shit. I ain't gonna lie. So How would we ever end up in the crazy. same weight class or even close? Yeah, and I'm gonna do you that too. Maybe nothing, people so. can't tell by just watching on camera, but like, like off camera, I and am off cameras, off cameras in the the Giant, it. and you are Marty Janetti. So yeah, I would Peter roll your ass. No, man. you ever see? Would, you ever play the first Punch Out? The little like the little the little dude, and then you got Mike Tyson, I mean, and you just. Yeah. Well, because that's I'm us. too gangster to be drinking. But hey, I'm a, hey, I'm a white person. Hey, 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 that's crazy. That's like the relationship where you and your girl got each other blocked on Instagram and all that because y'all be beefing, but y'all be laid up in the bed together. That's a very domestic situation I got going on. Minded I am that I'm even willing to have a conversation with you because you literally have made threatening, weird ass remarks about my fucking three year old daughter. I ain't gonna oh. lie, you took it like that, okay? No, that's you literally like what that. you said. You didn't diss me. You didn't diss my guys. You didn't disrespect me, gang. So when I dissed out what you like, if you can't take what you diss out, gang, don't even play with me. Gang. I don't talk about people's okay, kids. Dad. I don't know where that. I came from. Yeah, see, now nah, here go the thing though. And this where Br Brick Baby and DW Flame, bro. Y'all gotta respect Famous Richard for this. For number one, st standing on B I B I. He's standing on business. And number two, we are all from the same place. My hood might look just like your hood. My hood might not look just like your hood. But you know what's in both our hoods? Poor school systems, no grocery stores, fast food all over the place. Uh, liquor stores, gun stores, depending on what state you're in, and Baptist churches and Catholic churches. That's what's in all of our neighborhoods, big dog. At McDonald's, a rallies, or checkers, depending on where you are, uh, uh, a Burger King, a KFC, a Popeyes, a churches, a Chinese food place, and somewhere to get some fucking wings and a sandwich. That's what's in all of our neighborhoods, big dog. So what we know, because we're all from these same places, and pizza. Because niggas love Italian food, and I don't even think Italians made the pizzas. I think that came from the Greeks. Anyway, go, sheesh. It's a little white mama up here, chicken. I try not to stare too hard at the cheeks with the kids around me. Either way, go. Um, I say all that to say this. Um, we all know that once disrespect is given, it's not for the person who was disrespectful to now determine the levels of disrespect. That they, Why don't you talk about kids? Why are you talking about my homies? Why are you talking about my dad homies? If you could talk about my dad homies or even my living homies and I decide I want to talk about your living child, that's that. You can't determine my level of disrespect. You got to make a cameo, bro. You want everybody to see you? The homie. Um, you want to you wanna now determine the level of disrespect or now you want to determine how disrespect can be given. But like, nah, bro, like he, he made a good point. If you can't dish it, don't take it. I mean, if you can't take it, don't dish it. No, 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 Diddy, no, whack, three finger, drinking a hot dog water. What you mean, gang? You took it that with me, gang, so I got disrespectful. When? You need the charger? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Anything else, bro? Anything else? Anything else? No. Okay, I work for you? Yeah. Okay. I guess I do work for you. I work for somebody. That's not management. When I say F management, that's not what I'm talking about. That's actually the CEO owner of the company right there. I don't ever say anything about your kids, your dead homies, nah, your family I'm members. Not. I didn't do any of that. A lot. When you on the internet playing a game, you Wait, what did I say? I don't do the, the, the kid games. I don't talk about people's kids. Man, on King Dave, and nigga, I'm on Auntie Gray. You on the podcast, wolfing on my name. You invite niggas up here. You ask what me did I ask say? I, why you, what why did I you, say why that you, made you want to insult my kid or, uh, or threaten my kid or whatever the case might be? Uh, you said I was scared. I was scared to come back to no jump. I was scared of crib match. That was like that last niggas, week. That niggas, I'm talking about this. What this was added on. Then I seen a whack 100 interview. You like I made him. He won't be none without me. Okay, I'm what on the gas. That was when we said, already Ooh. had problems. You saying the shit about so my kid came up. before all That's that. That's because you don't. Nah. Got, he you don't have no dead homies. He could this. So yeah, I got go tons of dead homies. Okay, you just don't know who they are. You're too ignorant to do your research. Yeah. Uh, on BD for you play with me. Nah, with I'm gonna be real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really want Anyone to watching this could list off all the dead people from from my history. Yeah, I mean, so but they, they, so the DW Flame is in the corner laughing because this is flu flammery skullduggery and larceny at its finest. Yeah, so was, they think you a culture boss again. They think you just bring them up from Chicago up here to get some views. So what, you think you're gonna come on here and just read like the you dumbest the YouTube nigga. comment nah, and know, just call me a culture vulture and it's gonna be like, oh shit, nigga. Killer. It's all black people on King David, nigga. Do you, hey, he's black. He do you even believe in God? No, listen, no, you, I do not. listen to this. What? He's black, so he fits the hold description. On, hold on, hold on. Do you believe God, bro? No, obviously not. Everybody knows I don't believe in God.
You an atheist? Yes. Damn, Kyle, I didn't know that. Damn. You a devil worshiper? No. That's not what that means. So you don't believe black people are the real Jews? <laughs> I heard that about you. On Dave, do you believe black hey, people are the real where, Jews, where? bro? You went out there. So that... <laughs> Why did you go out there with the Jews? Cause was that for crowd? You had the camera. Nah, that's real on, shit. Cause you know I live in New York, and them Jews like they they was they had something going on a secret operation under them tunnels. They was what like the sex fuck? trafficking, all type of shit. They were just okay. praying. In they right? weren't just praying in them synagogues. Sure they were just praying. Okay, yeah, they, they that's never praying. what it looks hey, like. That's crazy. Gang, I'm but, telling you, but, 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 mile that. tunnel. But what made you think that you was supposed to be the nigga to go down there and do Cause that? Cause ain't nobody yeah. gonna do that. Okay. Ain't All nobody right. gonna do that. I'm that nigga that's gonna do something. Ain't nobody gonna do. Gang, okay, so you the chosen one. I you for sure somebody who gonna do shit that niggas ain't gonna do. That's for sure. That's for sure. Cause the things you do, I just be like, what's up with this nigga? I I agree a hundred percent. For sure, and ain't no cloud chasing none of that game on BD and nigga. I, 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 like I know what I know on BD. I know my history. I know what I know. These people stole our culture. Game. So stole, what you saying they, they was doing? Bro, what you saying they was BD. doing under there? The European, uh, the Russia just exposed that Jesus was black, right. and they just you see, they Russia did. Yeah. We ain't even Russia did, they opened up one of the oldest churches in Russia, and all the paintings of the uh, uh, prophets was black. They were all dark skinned. So to answer your question, no, I don't think that the blacks are the real Jews. What? I think that the Jews, the Israelis, seem to be the real Jews. Why do you think that? They, they, Y'all is Caucasians from the mountains. What's your okay, What's your argument? What you mean? What's my argument? For why yeah. you're the real Jew? Black people's the real Jews, bro. Y'all stole our Y'all stole our religion. Y'all stole us. Why you call me a Jew? Yeah, I'm not. Y'all not us. You can't bro. say y'all. You, wait, hold on. You Jewish? No. You ain't Jewish? No. <laughs> you got kind of disappointed. You know what you could say? <laughs> well, you know, you're not, you know you, what, you, he's not Jewish. He's not. He's Jewish. He's an atheist, nigga. Would that mean he don't believe it? Management, I want you to know that I know enough to know everything, and knowing everything is knowing enough to know nothing about this subject. No public opinion. At all. Here at Teenage Trap News Network, we love everybody. Christians, Catholic Jews, Muslims, uh, Protestants, Methodists, um, Satanists, if that's what you're into, your business, atheists, I might have said that twice. We love everybody. Nothing is. Everything is. What, whatever your is is, you feel me? We love you here at TNN Trap News Network. We're for everybody here at TNN Trap News Network. We don't discriminate. We love everybody here. All are welcome, except for the clan. They can't come. Or the Nazi lowriders. Or the Minutemen. Or any of those other like little stupid white supremacy groups that make you guys dress up like, like bad Halloween costumes out of like Dollar Tree. You know, that kind of stuff. Who makes a ghost costume out of a sheet? You look stupid. You look stupid. That's a terrible fashion choice, and that's an even worse reason to get your A double double whip because you decided to go outside dressed poorly. I digress. I digress. Now we're here to talk about management. I know enough to make. Back to the Contiana. They, nah, you don't he, even know what you said. Shout out to you. Shout out to Signature Raps, man. Make sure y'all go into your local dispensary, or I'm sorry, local we, uh, smoke shop. Get those, man. It's the yellow packet says TI. Get in your local dispensary. Get tasty live, current, live resin disposable cartridges. Cannabis dried terpenes, uh, it's five of them in each box. It's a whole list of things from each box. I go get them. They're a great product. You know what I'm saying? I just finished blowing me a, a little woo wapper, uh, you know, whatchamacallit out that honey bur uh, not the honey bourbon. No, we're not doing that no more. Get that. Management, I know enough not to talk about that public either. Anyway, uh, the T.I. Woody Bam, fire. Let's get into that, though. Let's keep going. Yeah. Uh, atheist, somebody don't believe in God. He don't believe in none of that shit, gang. He don't believe in none of that. So how the fuck is he a that. Jew? Cause some, they but told me be, he was a Jew. You could be a could Jew be by ethnicity, you know? Yeah, there's a ton of atheist Jews. Jews. You could be an atheist Jewish person. Okay, yeah. Who abide by when the tradition. When he first started... I don't even think you had. Did you have tattoos when you first started? Yeah, I had tattoos since I was a little That's why he was, a, he was a Norbit, a straight. Like, he's still a Norbit on King David. Like, what the f is a Norbit? That's a goofy, funny. a straight Norbit on King no, David. No, I feel like you're, you are pretty much like the definition of a goofy. Oh, the guys. When they invented the, that the term, gang, I feel King like David. they were kind of like predicting your existence. This is for the neck, gang, on King David. I'll be. Rolling around all that, but it's like in real life, ain't nobody gonna play with me on okay, King Day. I, I heard a lot of people play with you. <laughs> ain't nobody gonna play with me on the net. Ain't nobody gonna pull up a video of me and nigga playing with me. I heard your pipe got took a bunch of times. Ain't no, ain't no nigga ever put to my it, pipe then on King Day. I heard you had to pay for it back. Who told you that? The streets. Yeah. yeah. If you get your Blake took and then you pay for a new Blake, why wouldn't you just go buy a new Blake? Why would you pay for a new Blake? Why wouldn't you just go buy a new Blake? Uh, Who told you that? The streets. You know, I do all these Chicago interviews. They talk to me I'm afterwards. Like, they feed me information. They tell me yeah, about can't scenarios. Nobody tell you about, can't nobody tell you about me. Ain't nobody, nigga, ain't nobody nigga, did nothing to me. Ain't no King David, nigga. 
If a nigga did something to some y'all, I wouldn't come on, gang. Like, on BD, bro. Like, I heard Asian dog took your pipe. You troll, gang. Yeah, it's so good for Asian. <laughs> What's wrong with him? He over trolling. <laughs> Listen, hey, you say that that he brings Chicago niggas over here to do views, right? Yeah, just so they can mention other niggas. We like interview it. rappers. You fit the description because you are a Chicago nigga over here, and the reason. But I'm why not mentioning these here, niggas, gang. I'm on some other different shit. You talk about everybody you've ever heard of. I'm the reason why you back is because the ops came up here, popping it. That ain't even why I'm back. Them niggas on King David. <laughs> I came back because Adam told the, the he told I, the I net. I was scared to come back. Then Adam was bleaking. He was, using my name for clickbait. Then he doing all. I was really on Adam ass on King David. You did tell us That's you didn't I, want to come because you were shook. Oh, King David, I ain't never told you. You called us last minute. You were already Lord. on the schedule. You called us the last minute. You're like, Brick Baby's there, skull emoji. I'm not coming. Shorty on the guys he laughed. For what's wrong with him, gang? On King Dave, and they gon' Giselle Weekly. I ain't never said no shit like that in my life. I would life, try gang. to DM you like us. You gang. Up. I'm really with this on BDN. BDN, I would have just put up here by myself on King Dave. BDN man. You know what I'm saying? By default, I hey, got to Hey, you. stop over trolling me, gang. Get your goof ass, your freaky uh, ass on. We still gang. haven't got to the to the real. I'm just called this nigga freaky. <laughs> oh my god, bro. This shit is hilarious, bro. Famous Richard is funny. Famous Richard is funny. Point here, which is because low key he applied pressure to Adam Twenty Two, and Adam Twenty Two is for sure hiding behind DW Flame and Break Baby because I don't think he had that same energy if DW Flame and Break Baby wasn't right there. But Breed, but DW Flame and Break Baby, they allowed it. They allowed it. This is funny. Why you decided to go over the line and bring my kid into it when there was no reason to, Dang. when nothing well, I, was, I had said even came close to warranting that kind of reaction. To me, that's hey, some whole hey, ass hey, shit that I don't f with. That's some whole ass shit. Yes. On King Dave, you was trolling me, so it's like I what trolled. you got to tell me what I said that came even close to deserving that kind of response. You said a lot of shit, gang. You was just trolling me, trolling the city. Hey, every time somebody came up and you mentioned me, gang. On King Dave, it sounded like, like, sound like did he say that? He's you don't troll about the kids. That's what he's telling you. Like, what made you bring the kids? Yeah, yeah. that's what I'm saying. He's disrespecting me, gang. Is, 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 is there rules in trolling? I'm asking. No. Like, just asking. I mean, there's rules in being a hoe ass, whatever, and I feel who like. Who ass nigga? He's saying. He's the saying, guy who starts making these kids is usually the hoe. He's calling me a hoe ass nigga. I think that's some hoe ass behavior. I and I think I care. deserve an apology. Why are you asking for me to unblock you when you owe me a fucking apology for talking about my kid? Oh, he's pissed. He's white man pissed. But again, I don't think he goes so hard at DW Flame and Brick Baby and Security wasn't right there. Would you pr would you press your issue if they weren't there? At this point, Famous Richard has an excellent opportunity. This is when all stopping and yelling comes and all that yelling and ha ah, loud noises. That's when all that stops. So you you mad you all pink in the face. You trying to go put some whoop these over words outside? Is what you telling me? You want to go get a fair one? Is what you, because you hollering at me and you all pink in the face and you spitting all over the microphone. So you want to go uh, put some whoop these over some words? Or you going to tone it down how you talking to me when you continue this conversation, big dog, and put words over whoop these? But I'm, 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 I'm actually all right with both. But famous Richard's not gonna do that. He's gonna probably turn down. But let's keep going. Oh, King David, you owe me apology. If I apologize to you, gang, you gotta apologize. What am I apologizing to, me, to you for? Because you disrespected me, gang. You trolled me. You you, you still can't you even name what I fing said or did. Guys, you be asking niggas about me. Oh, he's a goofy. Yeah, he's not a fake BD. That all, all came after, after you talked after, about after my kids. New shit kids is added on. That's even worse. You just run after you talked about the kids. You just run the ops up here and gave them an interview, gang. You giving these a passport. I can't figure out what would make famous Richard just say that. Something had to have been said in famous. Richard just might not be able to articulate what was said in Adam 22, taking advantage of it to make it seem like he's not having an actual valid point. However, I can't imagine that somebody would just bring up somebody's kid for absolutely no reason. I just woke up, hey, it's a random Wednesday. Let me start talking about this guy's kid. Like, I don't, I don't see that. Ops, my ops. Is it? Yeah. Oh, that's bogus. That's bogus. That's bogus. See, even your friends are telling you you're bogus for it. You, you, you can't do I ain't gonna lie, my man fucked up then, because I was. I'm just on my auntie. Great, my man fucked up, That's man, some I'm just talking white shit, gang.
Yeah, that ain't no child's the white shit. Is. He talk about kids and people. He go across the line, bro. That's Charles. Like, like, nigga, you can say whatever about a nigga. Nah, yeah. that's if a nigga hits you a certain way, ain't no more can they? But then you let words get to you, cause you got it. You got to poke your chest out. Cause he steady told me I got a you thousand fans hitting me I, up I every day. That. All you me got too. every time me he too. say something, they believe I this I nigga on King Dave. I done been through way worse. They're tapping with the truth. I ain't no truth. Get your goof ass on you, freaky out of his ass. It's zesty ass. We have been through way like, worse. Yeah, we've been through worse than that. That's what I'm saying. And this bro. is the thing. You this gotta, is the thing. Poke your this is what's yeah. important for you to understand. I ain't a T Rel. I'm really Who from the fuck where is I'm from. Is real? Who and bro? I really Who don't the fuck accept is people talking about my kid in my face. You see what I mean? This controversy. What? He just mentioned a nigga I don't even you know. You can't so talk about my real kid and expect me to now just laugh and go along this, with it. Now when T-Real see this, I'm going to be in. Who the fuck is T-Real? No, he ain't that's nobody. That's the, but he's somebody that lets you make yeah. jokes about his kid and say, fuck your kids, fuck your dead homies. You can say that to his face and he'll just laugh and roll with it because he ain't really about shit. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying... I'm not that kind of guy. You ready for? You the start last talking one. about my kids. Yeah, I ain't I'm gonna no and overreact and overwhoop about it. Yeah, you blocked me all type of shit again. I ain't even know. I'm thinking I was just. I'm trolling you back, yo. I ain't gonna. That was an unnecessary shot. So that was goofy behavior. That was goofy behavior. Now in this instinct, if T Real was to go crazy and say "f your kid" or whatever, blah blah blah, "f your wife" and go on a tangent, it will be well deserved. And you couldn't say he was wrong because that was an unnecessary shot. So if you send an unnecessary shot, somebody double back with unnecessary ammunition, go for an unnecessary, you know, overkill. Then hey, we you started playing the unnecessary game. And that's just that. Oh, but it's like. You told me every single day. Every time somebody come on here for who in Iraq, anybody, you gonna ask them about me? But I think you're in the it, order of events because it all came from the fucking shit with my kid. Before that, it was before I that. didn't care. After the crib night thing, left, you and I both know that we shook hands and were laughing and taking pictures and shit after the crib night thing. No, it was no big dead, deal. Okay, it dead. was fun. All right, man, that's the end of that. We finna get up out here to the next one. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. More to get content. We got going on here at TNA Tribe. News Networks, news, you use some knowledge, okay? Get in nobody's college, man. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Get into that, man. Find my newest song, something gone, man. Get into that. If you ain't got into that, find me on Instagram, Trap News Network, T-R-A-P-N-E-W-S-N-E-T-W-O-R-X. And if you need to get into this live music review, Instagram, get into it. The link is in the description, T-R-A-P-N-E-W-S-N-E-T-W-O-R-X. It's May the 12th, Sunday, May the 12th, 3 o'clock in L.A., 6 o'clock in New York. Get into that, man. We will get you registered. Fall into the Instagram DM. We'll get you registered quick, fast, and in a hurry. Signature Honey Cigars. Get into those if you ain't got into those. Shout out to T.I. Shout out to Helm uh, Signature Cigars. Make sure you get the yellow pack. And am I bothering you? Am I bothering you? Oh, because you didn't breathing all hard. Like, just the homie. Um, <laughs> Tacey, live. You tired? You tired? Yeah. There was a lot of running at that park, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I know. Um, tasty live disposable cartridges, man. Make sure I get into those live resin disposable cartridges. Get into those cannabis derived terpenes. Yeah, bro. You waiting on your brothers? Can I finish my outro? Yeah. All right, bet. Um, live cannabis derived block. We got it to the next one, man. Free Avenue Angel until he's free. We go.